This week's Torah reading is the portion Bamidbar. It means in the wilderness, and it's the first portion in the book Bamidbar, which is the fourth of the five books of the Torah. The portion begins immediately with a phrase of how God is speaking to the people. God spoke to Moses as they were encamped at Mount Sinai from the Ohel Moed, from the Tent of Meeting. It has been two years since the exodus from Egypt. In that time, they traveled, they fought with the Amalekites. They encamped at Mount Sinai, experienced the wondrous revelation of God at Mount Sinai of the Ten Commandments, and they heard Moses teach the Torah to them. They built the Mishkan, the portable sanctuary, to be used in their march through the desert, and they instituted the sacrificial system. A lot of work done in two years' time. In all of that time, God was speaking to Moses and to the people from the top of Mount Sinai, from a great distance away, and in the context of, of awful sounds and loud noise, it was a frightening experience to hear God's voice. Awesome, but frightening at the same time. Now, at the start of this Torah reading, we're told that God speaks to the people from among them, from the tent of meeting. The portion goes on to explain how each of the tribes were to be, was to be encamped around the Mishkan. While they marched, and while they were camped, each tribe had their special spot, and each family within that tribe had its special spot all around the Mishkan, Mishkan in the center of the people, and God in the center of the Mishkan. What a beautiful image that is, as the people begin their journey to the, the promised land, to the holy land, a land of their, the dreams that they've maintained for centuries, where their ancestors lived, Abraham and Sarah, Isaac and Rebekah, Jacob, Rachel and Leah, the ancestors of the Israelite nation. As they were marching there, they had the confidence to know that God was with them. And not only was it an abstract idea, but it was a physical idea. God spoke to the people from the midst of the Mishkan, right in the center of the entire congregation of Israel. As we are about to ex uh, celebrate the holiday of Shavuot next week, uh, this portion by Midbar is always read on the Shabbat before Shavuot. So not only do we are reminded of the history by reading Ba Midbar every year, but we are connecting this to the holiday itself as we celebrate the holiday of the giving of the Torah. Torah is not distant. God is not distant. God is among us. It is in the midst of the people, in the heart of the nation, in the heart of each and, us, each and every one of us. All we have to do is be open and be aware to God's presence in our lives. Shabbat Shalom.